Hey there, Kim Loss here again. Today we are setting sail on a journey to debunk liver cancer myth that might be clouding your understanding. Thinking of this myth like tangled vine waiting to be untangled. Let's shine a light on the reality as we sail through five common liver cancer myth. Myth number one: liver cancer is exclusively caused by alcohol. Have you ever thought that only brains can make plants grow? Well, liver cancer is a bit like that. While alcohol can be the factor, it's not the only one. Liver cancer isn't just for people who drink a lot of alcohol. There is something called non-alcohol fatty liver disease, and it has nothing to do with alcohol. It's more likely thinking that all storms come with rain, but some are just windy. What are the causes of liver cancer? Alcohol. Excessive alcohol consumption for long period can increase the risk of liver cancer. Non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. This condition is linked to obesity, diabetes, and high cholesterol. It can lead to liver cancer even if you don't drink alcohol. Hepatitis. Coronary infections with hepatitis B or C virus can rise the risk of liver cancer. Cirrhosis, due to various causes, including alcohol, can increase the likelihood of liver cancer. Environment toxin, exposed to certain environment toxins like alpha toxins found in moldy peanuts can be a risk factors. Genetics, some genetic conditions like hemochromatosis can rise the risk of liver cancer. Smoking. Smoking cigarette may also contribute to an increased risk. It's important to know that not everyone who develops liver cancer is an alcoholic. Various factors, including non-alcoholic causes, can play a role. Myth number two. Lifestyle has no impact on liver cancer. Have you ever thought that the way you live doesn't affect your risk of liver cancer? Well, it's essential to understand why your lifestyle matters in preventing this disease. Thinking of it like this, just as a ship's captain's decision can change the ship's course, your lifestyle choices can alter your health path. Here's why. Weight management. Maintaining a healthy weight is crucial because obesity can lead to fatty liver disease and inflammation, both of which increase the risk of liver cancer. Dietary choices. Your food habits matter because a diet rich in fresh foods and vegetables can provide essential nutrients and antioxidants that protect the livers from damage. Physical activity. Regular exercise not only helps you maintain a healthy weight, but also reduces the risk in fatty liver disease and inflammation. Alcohol consumption. Drinking too much alcohol for a long time can harm your liver and increase the chances of getting cancer. So it's important to cut down your alcohol. Smoking impact. Smoking is harmful to your liver and overall health increasing your risk of various cancers, include liver cancer. Basically, your lifestyle choices can impact your liver's health, either by protecting it or putting it at risk. Thinking of it like taking care of a garden, how you care for it can help it flourish or let it die. Making healthy choices is like planting seeds of well-being that can help prevent liver cancer by keeping your liver healthy and resilient. Myth number three, liver cancer is uncommon and insignificant. Have you ever thought that only few lucky people can see the star twinkling in the sky? Well, liver cancer is like a bit like that. Some folks believe it's real and not worth worrying about. But here's the reality. Liver cancer is more common than you might realize. In the United States alone, around 41,210 new cases will be diagnosed in 2023. It's somewhat similar to finding groups of stars in the dark sky that you didn't see before. 
Liver cancer is not something we can ignore because its rate has shot over the years, tripling since 1980. It's here and it deserves our attention. Why liver cancer is so common? Risk factors. Several risk factors such as chronic hepatitis infection, B or C, obesity, and non-alcoholic fatty liver disease have become more common even in recent years, increasing the risk of liver cancer. Changing lifestyles, unhealthy lifestyles, including poor diet and excessive alcohol consumption, contribute to the rising incidence of liver cancer. Delayed diagnosis. Liver cancer may not show symptoms in their early stage, which can lead to delayed diagnosis. By the time it detected, it may have advanced. Global trend. Liver cancer is not just a concern in the United States. It's a problem around the world, and many countries have seen more people getting it. So, liver cancer is not uncommon or insignificant. It's a growing concern, and understanding its risk factors and taking steps to prevent it such as getting vaccinated against hepatitis, maintaining a healthy weight, and avoiding excessive alcohol can make a significant difference in lowering the risk. Myth number four, no family history, no risk. Ever thought that if your family doesn't have a history of something, you are in a clear? Well, that's not always the cases, especially with liver cancer. You see, some people believe that if no one in their family has had liver cancer, they are safe. But here the thing, liver cancer can sneak up on anyone, even if it's not in your family tree. Why liver cancer can happen without family history? Risk factors. Liver cancer can often link to certain risk factors like chronic hepatitis infections, obesity and excessive alcohol use. These factors can increase your risk whether or not anyone in your family has had liver cancer. Genetic changes. Sometimes genetic mutations or change can occur in your cells leading to cancer even if these changes aren't inherited from your families. So don't assume that Having no family history of liver cancer means you are risk-free. It's essential to be aware of the risk factors. Make healthy lifestyle choices and go for regular checkups to catch any potential issues early. Myth number five, liver cancer's impact is limited. Have you ever thought that when something happens, it's only stay in one place and it doesn't affect anything else? Well, some folks believe that liver cancer only messes with the liver and doesn't bother the rest of the body. But here's the truth, liver cancer's impact goes beyond just the liver. It's like when you drop a stone into water and it creates ripples that reach far and wide. Liver cancer can have consequences that spread through the body. Which is why it's essential to understand and address it. Why liver cancer isn't isolated? Spread. Liver cancer can spread to other parts of the body, such as the lungs, bones, and lymph nodes, making it concerned beyond the liver. Liver function. The liver plays a crucial role in many bodily functions, including filtering blood and processing nutrients. When it's affected by cancer, it can distract this function, impacting your overall health. Symptoms Liver cancer can cause symptoms like weight loss, fatigue, and jaundice, which are not limited to liver, but affect our well-being. So, don't underestimate the risk of liver cancer effects. It's not like a quiet echo in an empty room. It can create waves that touch various aspects of your life and health. Understanding its potential impact 
and seeking timely medical attention are essential steps in addressing liver cancer comprehensively. Liver cancer is when some cells in your liver start to grow in trend way. Your liver is a part of your body that helps with things like cleaning your blood and helping you digest food. But when these liver cells grow wrong, it's called liver cancer. There's a few things that can make liver cancer more likely. Sometimes, infection like hepatitis B or C can cause it. If your liver has a lot of scar, which can happen if you drink too much alcohol or have certain disease, that can raise the risk. Having a liver with too much fat can also make it more likely. Exposure to harmful chemicals or having family members with liver cancer can also increase your risk too. If you have liver cancer, you might feel things like losing weight without trying, pain in your belly on the right side, turning yellow because of jaundice, feeling really tired, or not feeling hungry. But remember, these things can also be caused by others' problems. So, it's important to see a doctor if you have them. The good news is that if doctors find liver cancer early, there are treatments that can help. So, get regular checkups with your doctors, especially if you have any of the things that can make your liver cancer more likely. It's an important step in staying healthy. Thank you for joining me today. Before you go, remember to tap the share button to illuminate the shadows of misinformation. If you found this insight relatable, please share. And don't forget to subscribe for more informative myth clearing adventures. Let's dispel the darkness of myth and march forward hand in hand with knowledge. Until next time, keep seeking the truth and keep shining bright.